Hey guys, so it's like a quarter of seven o'clock. Um, we already called the hospital to make sure that we still have our scheduled time. Um, I was told to take a thousand milligrams of Tylenol um, beforehand and um, drink some Gatorade to keep my electrolytes up. Um, Cause they said, you know, you have to prepare for recovery as much as you can before. I already um, shower with the um, showered with the high B cleanse um, to reduce the risk of um, post-operative infection, and um, we're basically ready to go. Um, I have to get some Gatorade. Oh, I mentioned that already. The yeah, bag is right there by the door, and that's his diaper bag. But that's gonna stay in the car. Yeah, we're leaving. I'm the type of person I actually don't like being, unless it's like vacation, I don't like being out of my space for too long. So I'm just hoping the next three days is not too uncomfortable. But yeah, he's almost here. Last, last half a day or a couple hours with this belly. Hey guys, welcome back to the Chronically Fearless vlog. It's Tasha. As promised, I've compiled um, the videos of my labor and delivery experience, having placenta previa, and a scheduled C-section. So if you're interested in learning more, please stay tuned. That's actually my bag, and this is his. I've got the bigger one. <laughs> Two. It's, it's my big day. Baby Dash is about to be here finally. Super excited. He's going to be a blessed young man. Mm -hmm. He's about to put on his big old suit. Look at your daddy. <laughs> and just like that, we had our baby boy. Um, after I went in for my epidural, he came out in what felt like just like two or three minutes. And we welcomed him. I got you. Yeah. Here we go. Thanks, Taylor. Yeah. All right. No, Hey, guys. So I finally have some energy to record again. Um, this has been a beautiful day. Um, whew. Ashton was born at 11:15 a.m. Five pounds and nine ounces. Um on the small side but they said he's um that's um, normal for his gestational age which is 37 weeks and two days um but yeah he was a little startled coming out um so waiting just a little bit for him to like to hear him cry and breathe was a little bit uh nerve-wracking but he was fine um they were able to get past my placenta being an anterior previa anterior previa um, and they said I did great as far as bleeding and all that stuff. Um, right now, I know you guys want to see him probably. Right now he's in the, at the nursery. Um, he's on a warmer just for about 30 minutes because he nursed really well coming out, but he hasn't done it again. He's just like licking it. So they said um, they want him to be more comfortable. So his temp is, um, you know, they just wanted to bring his temperature up. Then we're going to attempt um a nursing session again but my milk production or colostrum production for now is like it's coming out a lot so thankful for that dad is right over there hey he is so happy <laughs> i love my baby boy he is so happy we both are 
Um, just this 30 minutes that he hasn't been in the room, we're like, yeah, you never realize how much you miss people. Um, I'm eating now. Um, I, I just ate some Panera bread. Um, at first they started me on ice chips and then, um, I got upgraded to be able to drink some water and jello, have some jello. Um, but around 7.30, she said I could eat. So I had some soup and salad from Panera Bread. Um, and yeah, I'm gonna take some colace um, to soften, you know, whatever might pass through after that. And he already peed um, twice, I think. Um, Dad changed his diaper. Um, right now I still have a catheter in and some other stuff so I can't really get up and walk around until they take that out she said hopefully she should be able to take it out later on tonight um, so that I can get my body moving but so far I'm really not in a lot of pain there's soreness around my incision um, but um, I've just been doing asking them for the medications by the tick of the talk um, so that it doesn't like all hit me at once but yeah, Ashton is here. I can now call myself a mother. I successfully got through pregnancy and a safe delivery with multiple sclerosis and all. Um, and, you know, through placenta previa, through just um, being a black woman, I am very proud of myself. I want to thank me. <laughs> and I want to thank my man. My man, my man, my man. I wanna, <laughs> I wanna thank Anthony too, cause this has been a journey, but a good one. And he's the cutest little boy. We can't figure out who he looks like because we see so many people's faces in him. So we'll get back to you guys on that when we've reached a verdict. Um, but there are two people he's looking a lot like right now um or maybe three but yeah we'll get to that um but yeah i'm so happy I, I hope that the way i'm feeling now is kind of how i feel tomorrow i know the second day is when a lot of stuff kicks in my pain his crying will probably kick in more <laughs> tomorrow but he's very chill as of right now so yeah i will get back with you guys Maybe tomorrow, or if this nursing session goes good, um, I'll have Anthony get some of that without exposing y'all to my whole chest. But yeah. Mm. Hey, baby Ash, day two. How you feeling? It's day two. That's when you were born yesterday, and it's officially been 24 hours. <laughs> how how have your first 24 hours been, my boy? I hope they have been fun. I know you ate a lot, drank a lot of milk, mm -hmm. you look really cute, mm -hmm. talk to all your family, talk to your family in Maryland, D.C., Virginia, New York, Texas, Georgia, Cali, Liberia, Salon, you're an international superstar, boy. The people saw you in Liberia and Salon, they know about you, boy. They know about you, they waiting for you, they say you're the young chief. How you doing, mommy? Good. Um, this is 24 hours post C-section. I'll show you guys later what I look like in the bathroom. Hold on, let me step back. Let me see. <laughs> show everything. Yeah. Yeah. This is um. That's not bad for 24 hours. Here we are. Um, my whole core, not whole, but like from here to here, is very sore. Yeah. So I'll just stay on top of the medication. And it's all worth it because he's so cute, especially when he opens his eyes, you guys. Mm-hmm. He's really adorable. That he is. Yeah, and I have this big old robe on because it's cold. Mm. Thank you. Hey, little buddy. Hey. Hey, baby. Hey, guys, so this is me. 24 hours. Post C-section. Um, yeah, a lot of my stomach went down. It's very dark. Um, I'm about to try to pee and then um, do the other thing. <laughs> and yeah. 
But that's that's what it looks like. Last day, last couple of hours. How you feel, hey babe? Guys, I feel great. Whew. At four thirty, he finally latched on properly, so we are successfully breastfeeding. Well, not right now, but breastfeeding, but also supplementing because we just want him to be fed because he just had him took up to his circumcision. So I breastfed him a little bit, but I'm supplementing with um, this instant formula. And yeah, we're getting ready to go home, packing up, taking what we can from here. And yeah, Ashton is all ready to see his permanent living quarters. <laughs> you got your room ready, buddy. But yeah, C-section was successful. Circumcision was successful. Ashton's gonna be successful. Of course, young Ashton dad. Yeah, I'm ready to go home and take a shower and um, be comfortable because I don't like the shower here. So I did take one, I'm not dirty all, but yeah. It's time for us to go home. Yes. Yeah. And he's been cleared for everything. We're gonna um, leave in like an hour. Yep. All right. I love you, babe. Love you too. It's been great. And I love you too, Ashton Dash. <laughs> You're the star of the show now. We're one big happy family. Oh, yeah. We're a family of three now. Just need to add one or two more people. It's the or two. I don't understand what's happening. <laughs> Y'all are just talking. We'll see. Locked and loaded. The stroller. It's one of my favorite gifts. My parents got it. Out to go home. Finally on the way home. Oh, it's Sunday, July 10th. At 1.38 p.m. Hey, Ash. Thank you, Howard County General.